What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you a little secret that's gonna add another tool to your anabolic tool belt. If you've been watching the channel, then you probably understand that yes, going to the gym can be helpful for weight loss and building muscle, but there's nothing more important than your diet. If you want your body to be a Lamborghini, you're not putting regular fuel in it. You have to use that premium, that 93 octane. And today I'm gonna fill you all the way up. I'm gonna show you guys how to make a stupid, simple anabolic grilled cheese sandwich that is not only delicious, tastes just like the ones mom used to make, but it's loaded down with protein and fit right into your diet to help you lose weight and build muscle. And if you like the idea of having all the secret hacks to make your favorite foods healthy and diet friendly, then don't forget all those recipes are available in my anabolic cookbook, which you can grab at the first link in the description box. Not only is every recipe from the channel on here, but every time I add a new recipe, just like this video, it gets added to the cookbook for free. So once you have it, it really is the gift that keeps on giving. If you follow us in this book, I guarantee you'll see results no matter what. Hit that link down below to check it out. You won't regret it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, if y'all are ready to their epic video underway, then as always, man, I'm here to do it for you. Let's do it! Yeah! And before we hop into this recipe, I'm gonna give you guys a physique update. My shred for the summer started about a week ago. So I've dropped a lot of the initial water weight. away about 186. My goal is to get down to about 175. So I figure for accountability purposes, I'm gonna let you guys know that the shred has begun. And then as I keep posting videos and we start losing some of this BS, we'll be able to have it documented. If you want a closer look at me doing this shred, make sure you follow me on social media. All right, let's get to the Sammy. All right, guys, I'm telling you, this is so easy. I'm gonna have you in and out of here with a quickness. We're gonna start off by making sure we choose the right bread. And all we need to do when picking out bread is make sure that it's the lowest calorie option that we have. I really like this Nature's Own Butter Bread because it's only 60 calories a slice with 12 grams of carbs. And for everybody in the audience that's scared of bread thinking it'll make you fat, that is just simply not true. As long as we're eating less calories in day than our body needs, we can have all the bread we want. The first thing I want to do is lay out two slices of my white bread. And the first thing we want to do is make sure this is rich and creamy. My mom, as a kid, used to put mayo on my grilled cheese and I loved it. But now as an adult, I realize it's not putting my best foot forward with my diet. So what we're actually going to use is light miracle whip. I'm telling you, if you've never tried this on a grilled cheese, it's literally a game changer. And all I do is weigh out 15 grams and spread it on both slices of our bread. And now that we got the miracle whip spread, the next thing we need to do is select our cheese. Now, if you're using regular cheese, it's loaded with fat and has a lot of unnecessary calories, but we're going to avoid that by using fat free American cheese. I can get this at Walmart for really cheap. Every time I'm there, I'll grab two to three packs, keep them in the fridge because each one of these slices has five grams of protein with only 30 calories. That is absolutely insane. And a game changer changer when it comes to making anabolic meals at home. And all we're going to do now is put a slice of our fat-free cheese on each piece of bread. I told y'all this was easy. At this point, we are almost done. We need one final ingredient to ramp that protein up and add a ton of flavor, and that is gonna be deli shaved chicken breast. And when it comes to chicken breast, I like to buy the lower sodium version from Kroger at the deli. I think it tastes so much better. The macros are amazing, and if you look, you get a little bit of that skin on the outside. It's a little crispy and does wonders to making these sandwiches absolutely incredible. What we're gonna do now is weigh out 56 grams of chicken breast, put it on a microwave safe plate, then I'll toss it in the microwave for about 30 seconds to let it heat up. And then after it's heated up, all I'm gonna do is take my chicken breast, rip it into small pieces, and evenly spread it on top of our cheese. The reason you want to heat it up a little bit is that the cheese will melt while we cook this thing, but that chicken may not heat all the way through, and it can be a little cold if you don't do this little step. But if you take that little bit of time, you're going to be eating anabolic and making gains in no time at all. And now that our grilled cheese is built, all I'm gonna do is put on the top bun, press down a little bit, and then what we're gonna do is grab a large skillet, I'm gonna hit it with a little nonstick, and then we're gonna use the secret weapon, which is I can't believe it's not butter spray, zero calorie. What I wanna do is spray something right down in here, help us coat the underside of the bread. We're gonna take our sandwich, place it down in, then I'm also gonna go in and spray the top side with our butter spray. And now we're just gonna cook this thing like a good old fashioned classic grilled cheese. We need about two to three minutes each side on medium heat. Once the cheese is melted and that bread is crisped up and browned, you'll know you're gonna be good to go. I'm gonna let this do its thing and I will see you guys momentarily. And bingo. We got some cheese poking out the side. That bread on top is crispy. That means we're in a good spot. Last thing to do, take a knife. Give her a nice little cut, corner to corner. And bingo, baby. This right here is how you make the perfect grilled cheese.
Check it out, baby. We literally have everything we need in a sandwich right here. We got melted cheese. We got some good protein sources. We got buttered and toasted bread. All while making this sandwich not only delicious, but helping us work towards our goals. I'm telling y'all, you eat any of these recipes from my channel or in my cookbook, as long as you follow the rules that I lay out. I have videos on my channel explaining all this stuff, but as long as you're eating the amount of calories you need in a day and the amount of protein you need in a day, you will see results eating this way no matter what you do. All right, ladies and gents, if you made it this far into the video, please, for the love of God, smash that thumbs up button for me. Helps the channel out more than you know. Leave a comment down below, even if it's just an emoji. Every single comment helps the algorithm, helps the channel get more views. And of course, if you're not subscribed, please hit that button as well. Now, folks, before this cheese gets cold, let's go ahead and give this thing a shot. And before we bite into this sandwich, I gotta let y'all know that if you want super cheap supplements, the everything must go sale on finalboxfarmers.com is still going on. We have half off pre-workout, aminos with caffeine, aminos without caffeine. We even got turkesterone at the cheapest price you were ever gonna find it. You can literally get three bottles of this at a half off price with free shipping for around 75 bucks. And you're gonna save even more money if when you go to finalboxfarmers.com or theanabar.com and use code RJF10. Thank you guys so much for the support on this stuff. And seriously, if you try it out, I'm telling you, you're getting the best deal possible on some of the best of them as possible. Thank you guys for all the support. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Grilled cheese sandwich, you already saw it. You can probably already imagine what it tastes like, but rest assured people, whatever you think it tastes like, as good as you think it tastes, I guarantee it tastes better. Three, two, one, let go. Mm. I'm telling y'all, the addition of that light mayo to this, even just a little bit, ooh, it like combines with the cheese, makes it creamier. We got that good deli chicken breast there, that toasted bread. Mm, seriously, for being anabolic, this is one of the best grilled cheeses I've ever had in my life. Now in this entire sandwich, if you make it exactly how I did it, which end up with for the whole sandwich is only 264 calories, four grams of fat, 25 grams of protein, 32 grams of carbs with zero grams of fiber. 264 calories with 25 grams of protein, that is a surefire win. Literally on my diet right now that I'm shredding, I can literally eat eight of these a day, still lose weight, still build muscle, still keep things anabolic. And honestly, if I can teach anybody on this channel one thing, it's that all the preconceived notions you have about food, what you're allowed to eat, what you're not, you need to throw out the window. At the end of the day, all that matters is that we hit our calorie goal for the day. For everybody, that's a little different. For me right now, shredding, I'm around 2,200. For someone else bigger than me that works out more, that could be more, it could be a little less. You can always find that information on tdeecalculator.net, get you a good rough idea of what that should be. And if you eat under that calorie level and you eat enough protein for your goals for most men, that's going to be around 180 to 200 grams. For most women, it's going to be around 130 grams and you're gonna have optimal weight loss, you're gonna feel amazing, and you can literally throw all the bro science BS out the window about white bread being bad, you can't eat carbs past midnight, drinking diet soda actually makes you fat, you can throw all that stuff away and literally focus on those two things, simplify the process for yourself, and if you do that, it's gonna make this entire process way easier, way more delicious, and ultimately help you be consistent because you're not just fad dieting and eating foods you don't actually enjoy for short periods of time and then giving up because it was terrible. You eat this way, like the recipes on this channel out of my cookbook, you're gonna be going places, I guarantee it. And then boom, ladies and gentlemen, it happened too soon, but we are down to the final bite. Let's send her home. Mm. Quite literally, that is one of the best grilled cheeses I've ever had. You make it exactly how I showed you to do it, you're gonna be eating like an anabolic king or queen in no time. If you end up making this, tag me on social media, wherever your social at, Facebook, Instagram, wherever. Let me know what you think. And if you want easy access to all of my recipes, not just grilled cheeses, but we have pizzas, ice cream, donuts, things of that nature, then don't forget you can always grab my cookbook, available at the first link in the description box. I stand by what I said. If you follow us in here, you calculate the calories, you eat the recipes, you do everything I show you how to do in this book, you're gonna be seeing results no matter what. A real quick shout out to the apparel sponsor of the channel, Young LA. I'm rocking one of their cutoff tees right here, Young LA branding. Then I have on the Polar Fleece shorts, which are some of the most comfortable shorts I've ever purchased in my life. If you ever wonder what I wear in these videos, how to get such a good fashion sense, rest assured, everything that I wear is Young LA. You can always visit the site, check out what they got at youngla.com. Use my code RJF. You're going to save money. You're going to support the channel. And overall, I know you're going to be stylish while you do it. Appreciate you guys as always. Thanks for hanging out. Once again, thumbs up button, comment down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. means the world to me. And until next time, ladies. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll see every one of you at the next video. See you guys. Wham, bam, bam, baby. We gone.